Okay, uh, here are my pickups for today. Everything you see here uh, represents a measly 75, uh, 56, make that, $56 in spending by me. Um, I can confidently say there are no home runs here, um, but it's just a nice little assortment of stuff that, I, you know, I can sell at the flea market and make some money on. Let me just go through it quick. Um, these are fun. They're just, uh, I don't think they're old. Uh, they're made to look old. I don't know where they're from. But they're kind of nice. Um, they're roosters. Spanish people like them where we live. Other people like them. I paid three a piece. I will sell these anywhere from five to ten dollars a piece, depending on how quickly they sell. Um, got these. This this is a cake plate. And, um, it's white glass. It's got a pattern. Um, the handle's kind of corroded, messed up. Uh, it came with two plates. I only spent $3 for it, so um, there's flea markets I do. If I sell at $10, uh, that'd be fine. Um, this is an aluminum fish-shaped um, bowl. It's made by Arthur Court Designs, copyrighted 1976. Arthur Court stuff is kind of popular. I don't know a lot about them, but again, this was $3, so if I sell it for $10, um, I'm fine. Nice Murano bowl, paid four dollars. It's got a nice deep ponto on the bottom, and uh, otherwise it looks in pretty good shape. I'm assuming it's a cigarette bowl. Uh, this I paid again four dollars for. It. And, you know I can sell this anywhere from say ten to thirty dollars, depending on where I sell it. I'll probably sell it for twelve to fifteen uh, without too much trouble. Uh, got this ashtray, paid three dollars. I don't know if it's old or new, but it's kind of neat. It matches those lamps. Um, normally, I don't really buy this kind of stuff so much, but for $3, I'll, t I'll take a chance. Uh, most flea markets I go to, they don't really buy old stuff so much, so I save this for when I go to a different uh, flea market that buys this stuff. Uh, this is like those iPod dogs. Uh, you plug them in, they dance and stuff. I paid $4 for this, but I bought it with uh, something else to knock the price down. Um, sometimes you can sell these on eBay. You know, um, they're kind of cool. They dance, and I, sometimes they have lights in them. Uh, moving on. Um, oh, here's a half a Pepsi Cola salt and pepper shaker set. They only had the one, so I bought it. And I think it was a dollar. Um, perfumes today. Um, Elizabeth Arden green tea scent perfume. I paid a dollar for this, so uh, I'm not too worried about this. Royal Copenhagen spray cologne, not full. I believe I paid a dollar for that. Um... This I paid four dollars for, but it's uh, it was selling in Bloomingdale's, so I'm assuming it it has value. I'm not, I never heard of it though. Trouble, an invitation to Trouble Cologne. Uh, I don't know. Wait, wait, let me see. Oh, it's made by Revlon. Who knows? As long as it's worth twenty bucks, that's fine with me. Uh, here's a jewelry I got today. Uh, nothing special. And uh, like I said, I spent fifty-six dollars for everything, so I have very little into the jewelry. Probably the most expensive I spent on the jewelry. Well, I'll save for last. Um, things like this, I, I think I paid three dollars for, and we'll probably sell this for eight to ten. Or um, these are Swarovski earrings, not bad. On eBay, these should be a solid um, twenty to thirty dollars if I start at twenty dollars and put a buy it now price. Um, lion pin. We have people that like these things. I can probably sell this for five to eight dollars. Um, amethyst beads. This should be six to ten dollars. Uh, here are some bracelets. This one I'll probably... Oh, this one has praying hands on it. Um, this one I'll probably get like five to eight. And st these probably like three to... You know, I, I probably didn't pay much for these. Uh, these birds are kind of cool. But stuff like this I'll get like around $4 for... Uh, this is cute. You can put uh, your baby in there. Uh, $4. Something like this, 3 to $5. Uh, this is pretty cool. I should check this out. It's a uh, Folger Adam Company... This is a large key. I don't really know what it's for. It's got oh, clay all over it. I say green clay. Um, I'll check that out. And got these two little birds. Uh, this, I'm hoping, these were, were they're saltwater pearls. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry, freshwater pearls. And they have little coral beads. Um, and let me just bunch it together. I paid ten dollars for the three, so that's a great price in itself. Um, what I'm actually hoping, uh, they're not too easy to sell. So what I'm hoping is these beads that you see in between them are gold. If they're gold, um, uh, odds are I'm going to just cut the strands and uh, scrap the gold beads um, because it's easier to get rid of that way. And then maybe just sell the pearls uh, at a flea market for parts. Anyway, that covers everything I got uh, today.